Fire Station 10 in Norfolk may look a little different for a while. Penny Your Size Yeda Bedaneshi tells us why it is undergoing a major renovation. The campers here behind me at Fire Station 10 in Norfolk will be outside for a few months while the inside gets remodeled. It may take a few months before the dust settles at Fire Station 10 in Norfolk. This building was built in 1961, so the city and our administration is going around updating the fire stations. Captain Rodney Mills says the project just started this week. They're going to update the firefighters' bunk room and bathrooms, and then they'll be working on the other side, updating our galley and working on our uh, commercial uh, washers and dryers. Fire officials tell me the $900,000 to do the renovation is part of the city's capital improvement plan. The upgrades will provide a safer environment while also providing a better living environment with more privacy for first responders in sleeping areas and in the bathroom and shower areas. They'll also be getting central AC and heat and the plumbing and electric will be upgraded too. So where do firefighters and medics sleep? Right out front in these campers. Buildings in there. phone rings in there and we're able to do our reports and everything from the campers. Captain Mills says the electronics and city network is hooked up inside of the campers so there's no delay in response time. Three can sleep in one camper, two in the other, and then one person sleeps in a bed inside of the station. One thing about the fire service, we have to adapt to a whole lot of different situations so I'm quite sure this is just something that we'll adapt to. The entire process should take about five months. In Norfolk, Deanna Betaneshi, 10 on your side. A